I, I, when I was in school, I used every color I could afford. Uh -huh. And I had like 30 tubes of paint. Yeah. Well, I still have them. You know, I mean, I mean it was fun uh -huh. because you, no one, you know, no one told us what how to I paint have? or what to do. And so we just went to the art store and, you know, and just got, it was on sale and you'd take the lid. I go, oh, I really like that color. And, I and so I, I had, um, I used a fiberglass bus tray. I'd gotten because I was waiting tables at the chart house. That was my palette in mm -hmm. school. It was this big bus tray, huge thing. This it was great, and I just had paint all the way around it. You know, like I said, there's 30 or 40 piles of paint, and I'd put them out, and I would spend more time putting the paint out than painting. <laughs> and then I finally realized that one day I'm looking at it, going. I've only used like, these four I'm only colors. running out of five. You know, <laughs> yeah. So it was just like, this is stupid. So do you have your students buy only the colors mm -hmm. that you use mm -hmm. for your palette? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what, what colors are those? What are the main Elysian colors? Elysian Crimson is the red. Cad Yellow Medium is the yellow. And Phthalo Blue is the blue. So those are the primaries. And then a Cad, yeah, a cad Orange for this, a secondary. And then the, the Phthalo Green. Um, and... I basically tell my students, try these out, and if you like them, stick with them, and if you don't, then do what you feel you need to do. I'm gonna say 99% of my students stick with this palette, you know? Um, and and you, can add, you add colors as you need to. And most people add maybe a cad red. Mm -hmm. When you can't make a bright red. And, uh, and a, maybe a magenta, because we okay. can't make magenta. And magenta is kind of a cool color, um, especially if you're painting flowers. Yeah, I'm just you thinking. Need, but but that, those are about it. We can make everything else.